Hello everyone. Now I would like to show you a systematic English grammar while watching this video. Please concentrate. The adjective. Kinds of adjectives. Look at the picture. What do the sentences say about the picture? Look at the tall boy. He has a fat dog. Look at the short boy. He has a thin dog. The words tall and short show us how the boys are different from each other. The words fat and thin show us how one dog in the picture is different from the other dog. Tall, short, fat and thin are words that describe the nouns boy and dog. Such describing words are called adjectives. Words which describe something are called adjectives. All describing words are adjectives. Kinds of adjectives. Adjectives of quality. Read these sentences. Ashok is a kind boy. He helped the blind man. The Polish crow tried to sing. The clever fox walked away with the cheese. The word kind tells us what kind of a boy is Ashok. The word blind tells us what kind of man he helped. The word foolish describes the crow. The word clever tells us what kind of fox it was. All the colored words that describe what kind of a person or a thing is are called adjectives of quality. Adjectives of quality answer the question of what kind. Click true for the right sentence and false for wrong sentence. Sharp clever sweet or adjectives of quality true true some much little or adjectives of number false this that these or demonstrative adjectives true which what those whose or adjectives of quantity false remember work Catch or adjectives. False. Drag and drop adjectives of quality in the space given below. Kutub Minar is a tall man, rich. Tall. India is a great country. Great. The giraffe has a long neck. Long. The foolish straw dropped the cheese. <laughs> foolish Chandini chalk is a busy market. A and the. Look at the pictures. Now read these sentences. Apple is fruit. Umbrella is useful thing. Mr. Bali is grocer. He is honest man. Are these sentences right? No, they are not. The articles A and an are missing. They should be written as An apple is a fruit. An umbrella is a useful thing. Mr. Bali is a grocer. He is an honest man. When do we use a? 
We use a before a word beginning with a consonant sound. Example, a fruit, a grocer, a motor car, a bicycle, a useful animal, a one rupee note. When do we use an? We use an before a word beginning with a vowel sound or a silent H. Example, he gave me an orange. I want an egg. I gave her an ink pot. He is an honest man. He was an hour late. He is an Indian, but his wife is an American. When do we use the? The is used before a noun that stands for some particular person or thing. For example, the bag of barley was stolen. It means the particular bag, not any bag. Important. A or an means anyone. It is therefore called the indefinite article. The means the particular person or thing we are talking about, not the others. It is therefore called the definite article. Learn and remember. No article is used before proper nouns. Look at the examples given. Mumbai is a big city. Ashoka was a great king. America is a rich country. The is used before the names of rivers, oceans, mountain ranges, nations, famous buildings, holy books, and unique objects. Look at the examples. The Ganges, the Yamuna, the Nile, the Red Sea, the Indian Ocean, the Bay of Bengal, the Himalayas, the Alps, the English, the French, the Dutch. The Taj Mahal, the Red Fort, the Qutub Minar. The Ramayana, the Mahabharata, the Bible. The Earth. The sky, the sun, the moon, the world. Find in the, fill in the appropriate articles. Dash onion, an onion, dash tomato, a dash and an ant dash sun the dash himalayas the himalayas complete the sentence with a suitable article dash bible is the holy book of the christians the roy is dash honest boy an honest boy she is dash poor woman. A poor woman. Dash Indian Ocean washes, washes the feet of Mother India. 
the delhi is the dash metropolitan city a metropolitan city the adverb thank you for watching my video please subscribe and share it to your friends